Hi everybody, I'm back, and uh, I was going to be doing a quick what's in my refrigerator video. Uh, I've had a lot of requests, believe it or not, uh, before my surgery, and I will get into that, all the explanations and what's going on in the next video or soon. So, uh, first of all, I thought I would uh, pop on real quick and give you a shot of what we usually, this is normally what our fridge looks like. We have another freezer downstairs. I'm not going to take you down into our garage. It's not real, real beautiful right at the moment because I still have a lot of stuff back. But let's turn the camera around and I will show you a shot of our very um, ginormous collection of stuff in our freezer. So, in our refrigerator. Excuse the aim of the camera. So let me turn it around. Yeah, if you haven't seen food, and I just, I, this is not food stamps, believe it or not. We don't use food stamps, of course, you guys probably knew that. So I just got back from Costco, and I had so much stuff. Now, we do not, we eat really healthy. Most of the stuff is um, low fat, low in carbs. This is, uh, I love these creamies, um, like when I get heartburn or I don't feel good. I bought two of those for after the surgery. There's like 30 in there, chocolate, banana, orange. And then I've got waffles. There's so many of these. Um, they have to be frozen. The box is so big. I've got frozen chicken. Um, I love these. These are the Yaki Soba Bowls. Um, I don't know if my husband threw the box away. Um, and then I've got beer battered cod. I, the only way that you can get the beer taste to go away from this is to really cook it good. And I put it on a tray um, and bake it in the oven. And as long as you bake it long enough, the beer taste goes away. If you don't bake it long enough, it still, still tastes like beer. And it gags me. Then behind this, I've got stacks and stacks of Baja Fresh burritos, and they taste just like the ones at Baja. Ooh, a crumb. Can't stand that. So yeah, um, my husband takes those to work, but let me pull one out. They are awesome. You can get these at Costco. They're right from Baja Cafe, and they come in beef and bean and beef and cheese. Anyway, so yeah, we buy. I bought two bags of those. And then up here, he loves these egg rolls. We, we eat those. I bought two boxes of those. I've got more, more as you can see, um, waffles that came in a huge box. There, there, there. Another bag of chicken. Here's the yaki soba. They come with the uh, Ednami and Edanami and all that. Let me throw the ice back in and hopefully the freezer will close. I'm not seeing it. And then down here, yeah. Let me get the ice back in somehow. I just really don't want him to take that downstairs. I have to have that with my coat. Just let me shut it and stay there. Okay, now we're down here. He has to have his keystone. He has a beer when he gets home from work, which is fine. I put these waffles. These are normally supposed to be frozen. Should be okay. I've never tried this bacon before, but I heard it's really good, low in fat. I haven't really read the credentials. Um, it's rather expensive. I think it was three something for 13 slices, but comparably, um, it it deletes the mess. It's already cooked. You just warm it up. So for somebody that's sick and my husband not you know wanting to stand there frying bacon, I can't stand the smell of burnt bacon in my house and just. He hates the grease that splatters everywhere. It's just a big mess. So I bought two of them. And what what else I use the bacon bits bacon for is I crumble it up. And then I bought these at um, we love Brussels sprouts. I bought these. I buy all the vegetables. A lot of them at Costco. Is I'm gonna divide these into three. Let me just set it here. Divide them into three. The bag. And then um, I steam them. I'm going to steam them in a while, and then I put onions, garlic, um, and I take them out and add a little butter, salt and pepper, fresh ground, um, and then uh, add crumbled bacon, and they are awesome. They are really good, really good Brussels sprouts. So to freeze them, 
you just kind of want to blanch them or you don't want to cook them all the way um, I'm going to divide this bag into three for him and I that's way too many I mean look at how big those are so Anthony could probably put down about eight of those I could probably put down maybe five but I'm going to probably divide it into one two three maybe four servings or four dinners then I've got we make French dips we had those last night. I buy the best roast beef, the Angus. It was eight ninety eight a pound. Crazy, you can't see it. it was Seven fifty one. You can't see it. Focus camera. Anyway, I buy the best roast beef. This is not for sandwiches. He knows not to touch it. And then I put it on the the hoagie rolls over here. I only buy uh, Fran's bread. I put it on the hoagie rolls with um, a slice of cheese. I usually get Havarti, but here's the mild cheddar. Um, and then I buy the, um, excuse the camera shaking, I buy the Fran's Bighorn whole wheat bread. It's really fresh. Um, just got that. You never want to you never want to keep your bread um, on top of your microwave. Bad no no. Bad juju. It makes it go bad fast. So this is my drawer of cokes. It's always stocked. Whatever whatever's at left is downstairs. Then there's the water. We we do not drink tap water here until we get a water softener in our new house. Um, here's the mushrooms I'm going to cut up and take care of. I usually always have a salad made, like a seven layer salad, and then I store it in one of these. Where is it? This has a lid. I call it a seven layer salad. It has a matching lid, and then I just put it in here. And then when you want salad, I, we just put it on the table, and you can just, excuse the siren, you can just grab it like that, and you know, put some on your plate, and it's done. So yeah, I forgot to buy romaine, though. That's one small problem. So I'll have to do that tomorrow. So, we got our carrots, our celery, onion, I got some Gatorade, we always have that, ham for his lunches, um, if he doesn't want burritos, I can make him a wrap. Then I bought him this for, for when I get out of the hospital. We'll probably need to go shopping again. It'll be, it's the 15th, so deli ro oven roasted. This is what we like, Oscar Mayer, for sandwiches. And then I pack them. They make really thick sandwiches. These are supposed to be frozen. I don't know. There's eggs, waffles. He can pop these in the oven one morning. Um, this is the butter we use for high cholesterol. Brummel and Brown, it's yogurt. It tastes, it's not margarine, it's yogurt, but it tastes just like butter. And um, it's no fats, so yeah, it's just like margarine. We love it. So, a little more expensive, but then here we've got our sour cream. This one's almost ready to go. The one below it's full. Then I buy these baby carrots. We munch on these. They go in salads. I steam them. And then tonight, I think we're going to have top sirloin steak from, I buy my meat at Costco. This was $25.47. It's ribeye. Oh, it's ribeye, honey. Boneless tip. Sirloin. Ribeye. So, yeah, there's several steaks there. What I'll do oops, is divide them up in Ziploc and divide them into twos and put them in the freezer if I can fit. So yeah, that's what's in our fridge. Oh, and then there's cottage cheese, 2%. So yeah, there's lots of stuff to snack on. Now I can come over here real quick. So there's our door. Uh, we love these Vlasic pickles. Um, I love this sesame dressing. Put that on vegetables. Um, so yeah, there's our fridge. It's pretty packed. Um, I'm still going to get some more stuff in it. Behind me, I've got my... Um, my red bell peppers, my red orange, and I'm cutting them all up, putting them in baggies. Then I have my little cucumbers that you get at Costco, putting those in baggies. They come in a package like this, but if one goes bad in the pack, they all go bad. So there's that, and then this is, um, yeah, our pantry. It's kind of a mess right now. Excuse the mess. Yeah, just 
our oils, um, mom got us an Easter basket, crackers, tons of vitamins, olive oil, there's cereal up there, oatmeal, um, what are these, granola bars, chips, healthy chips, these are dill, these are the new cheesy garlic bread, excuse the siren, wheat thin, um, smart food, these are all pretzels, here's our coffee down here, this is, I really like this, I bought this yesterday, it's custom roast Folgers, anyway, so there's that, so I hope you guys enjoyed that, I will upload this, it was a requested video, I'll turn this around, so, yeah, um, that's everything, and, sorry, I've got it right in my face, that's probably better, anyway, so once I get us a little more situated, it's really bright, but from here it looks really pretty. If you look outside, it looks really pretty. The tree out there, if you can see it with the umbrella, looks gorgeous. So we got a new red umbrella. I can give you a close-up. There you go. Looks really pretty. Anyway, so. I will let you go. Um, I've got to run over to Target and pick up my soft blankie for after surgery and a couple more things. And I will see you back in a while. Sup, sup, sup. Do you have anything to say, Anthony? Hello. He said hello. He's tired. Thanks for watching. See y'all later. Sorry about the shakiness. Bye. Check